So we specifically ask them to not fry them hard. And I don't know, <clears throat> this chicken is like some kind of weird limbo because it's not fried hard to where the skin is crispy, but it's definitely dry. Like it's dry as hell. What up fam and welcome back to our channel. I'm Deb. Before we get into much today, make sure you subscribe and hit that bell to be notified when we drop goodies like these. Welcome back, it's such a treat. Great play fam, come on, let's eat. Thumbs up the video, let's get to at least 1K likes. We're not gonna complain if you get to more. Shall we pray? First and foremost, we'd like to give honor and thanks to God. We'd like to also thank you for those that are joining us in regards of what mood and temperament they have when they depart. We pray that it's uplifted, Lord. We pray that it's uplifted. Father God, I'd also like to thank you for revitalization and rejuvenation because oftentimes in life we can get so used to just pushing through and going, 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 going. We can get on autopilot and we can never take time to charge down and power down and charge back up. So in your son Jesus name we pray, amen, amen, amen. What we got for y'all today. So we got a combination loaded baker right here and we got some hot wings with one honey mustard wing. There, anybody who's anybody know the story behind the one wing, but if you don't, we'll get to it in a minute. What have y'all been up to? Hold on, as a matter of fact. All right, so anyone who's not new here will know what's the deal behind the one wing, one uh, all flavor wing. But my wife typically, and I do it to her sometimes too, um, she saw what I had, she said, ooh, babe, can I have one? But of course you can have one. So as I'm getting ready to come down, oh, babe, I'm gonna replace your piece of chicken that I ate. Okay, sweetheart. You ain't asked me, could I loan you a piece of chicken? You asked me, could you have one? But I took it because you know, sometimes when people are trying to offer gestures of generosity, While you may have the best intention while you, when you decline it, so to speak. When people are trying to reciprocate, the feelings of gratitude and respect, sometimes again, although they might not say it to you, you can feel like a slap in the face that you didn't let them do something for you, but you do it okay with looking out for them. Most people like even trades. The barbecue sauce. It does taste familiar like one of the big box chain barbecue sauces. But y'all saw those containers? One dollar. Most of our other spots that we go to get potatoes. For real. I feel like they charge me for the container. Put my sauce on my potato. I ain't export on the side. There are like four, five places here that, depending on who you talk to, people swear by certain locations and by certain locations, potatoes. So I might take a tour one week 
in each day or get a potato from each different establishment. And instead of doing it all in one day, space it out that way. I don't get burnt out on the flavor and then I start to just mesh them. So spacing them out a day will give them authentic time for each to flop or shine on its own. Today is the third of July. Which, of course, you know, today's third, you know, tomorrow's fourth. Um, my family and I are going to Spring Valley, not Spring Valley Beach. That was the original plan, but it changed. We're going somewhere here in Alabama called Point Mallard. While Jazz and I said, okay, you know what, we're going to sandwich it up. We're gonna fix some nice sandwiches while we out there. Another cousin suggested make some wraps, get some tortillas, make some wraps. But the rest of the family, they are absolutely convinced that the free grills that they have out there are not going to be occupied. And that we're going to be able to grill seamlessly. I told him, you know what? I'm not going to speak against it and say good luck, none of that. Well, I am going to say good luck because it still is a waiting game as far as when you arrive because it's first time, first serve. But I ain't going to say I'm going to see or nothing like that because I don't want to speak anything out of my mouth against your objective because I don't want to manifest anything negative. But y'all, there's a, there's a 50% chance of rain tomorrow. And like in our family, when we have gatherings and functions, everybody has their different things that they do. Tomorrow, Jazz's other little brother said that he is going to man the grill for the most part. Her uncle and aunt said they'll oversee and supervise him. But that came about like three hours after he initially said, oh, I'm in a grill. We handle food um, family potluck style. We came up with a list. And everyone just picked off the list what they would be bringing. Which eliminates confusion. And unnecessary to do and unnecessary duplications. Because there's no list and no plan in place. There's a high likelihood of multiple people getting the same things. is good. Now in that container, I want to feel as a type of way paying a dollar for the ranch. But barbecue sauce cutty. I also have a piece of caramel 
salted caramel cheesecake over in the cut. That's residual from Jazz Night's date night yesterday. We've been kid free practically all weekend. Um, Jazz aunt, she got the boys on Saturday. And we just picked them up about, what time is it? About three. We just picked them up about an hour and a half ago. They were originally supposed to go at about like five, six on Friday. But what we like to do, since we have a crew, all of our own, we like to send food to make it easier on our health. Cause Jazz not really feel like the easier you make it for someone to help you, the more enthusiastic they will be to not only help you, but help you again. So, between Jasmine's cousins and her sister, well, no, niece and nephew weren't there. But had they been there, it would have been the count would have been 16. But she was handling 14 kids, no, 12, because that's Miss Serena, why they are there. She was handling 12 kids by her own. So good. Twelve kids, y'all. So I don't know about you, but if I was sitting for twelve kids, I would take all the help I can get. So I'm sure they're not gonna turn down seasoned and or cooked food. And or meal prep food. Domino, give me all of it. The barbecue sauce really is like the most memorable thing of this potato. It's tart and this level is right on point. So Andrew says he wants to do some real food versus gummy challenge. That should be interesting, y'all. Cranking, it do be seeming and sounding fun on the front end. But believe it or not, we've had some crazy encounters with people that we know, family, friends. We've had traumatic experiences as like children. I'm talking about five to eight years old that still traumatize them and stick with them to this day. So it's like, although you say prank until you get to that point, they don't know that 
their body, their body and brain doesn't. So they're treating it like it's real. Kids had lasagna and Hawaiian rolls for dinner. And believe it or not, y'all buddy Dun Dun was the one that went in for the slaughter game. This boy had three plates. Drink the lemonade and think about something else, something else too, y'all. The spot where we got this from, they charge a service fee. When you're paying with a card. Now I know some people, if not most people like, excuse me. If not most people like, it's always been that way. Personally, when it comes to a service fee, I've only ever heard it mentioned in regards to not making a certain trans a certain minimal transactional limit. Hence five dollars, some places have ten dollars. With everything we had, we cleared thirty dollars easily. So the service fee should not have been applicable. But as Jazz and I read, are reading and looking at the receipt, they worked the cash register at a pharmacy when she was in college. So she looked at she said, uh-huh. That's what it is right there, babe. They pretty much did a bypass and ran as a credit. And I was like, okay. But correct me if I'm wrong though. As soon as she opened the window, she said what? They said $43. I'm like, so how did she know I was paying with a card? And if I would have given her cash after she said 43, realistically, is she going to modify the total? I had so many thoughts. That's how you know I'm a potato junkie. I'm eating two pieces of chicken and practically the whole potato. Well, by the time you see this, the video with me, Aiden, and Andrew will have, all, will have, will, goodness, have already been published. So, 
So in regards to that, that's actually, beside this one, the most recent video. I did film a video with another guest, but that data got corrupted on the SD card. Glass half full blessing though, is it's allocated to the SD card. It didn't pretty much corrupt and erase all of the footage. It corrupted it and made it more like a, um, like a text that PDF file versus a JPEG. So that's going to be interesting. Getting figured out. But that was like a 30 minute video. Uh uh. So we specifically ask them to not fry them hard. And I don't know, <clears throat> this chicken is like some kind of weird limbo because it's not fried hard where the skin is crispy, but it's definitely dry. Like it's dry as hell. Oh, we about to dive into this delectable looking salted caramel cheesecake. Well, this is where we went for dessert. We each got a cheesecake slice and we got one to split. Our one that we got to split was the tiramisu. Which, it was good. Was good was great though. Now, if I had to give something a great in the category, it would definitely be that um, Dulce de Leche cheesecake that they had. Oh, it's a Tres Leches. I'm gonna have to look in the menu to see what's currently on the menu 
and that will help me into identifying which one it was. Because if it's on the menu right now, then it's not the one that I'm talking about. Because the one I'm talking about was a while ago, and it's almost like it was a limited time offering. But as I sit here, I'm almost certain it was It was a Thrace Leches. So, so good. Y'all probably not gonna see this before we travel. Wish us safe travels. Cause even if we're back, we still going somewhere else at some point in time. Well, that was a nice meal on top off. Sadly, we have come to a point in the video where we must let you guys go. So until next video, fam, love you guys. Stay safe, stay blessed. Be that light for someone else to emulate because you never know what your kind words and gestures could do for the next person day.